making money online with digital products is fantastic because there are essentially no production costs. This indicates that practically all of the money made can be considered profit, and the margins can be very large. In addition, you don't have to worry about keeping physical stock, and your clients can start using your digital products practically immediately. So stay tuned, because I'll share with you 12 digital products that can generate a high return on investment from virtually any source of traffic. Welcome to Money Anytime, where we share money-making tips and tricks through online needs. The methods and ideas that we will share are guaranteed up-to-date and surely doable at home, so you can earn money anytime. So if that's what you are looking for, don't hesitate to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell, so that you'll be the first to know what next money-generating trick we have got up our sleeves. You can also leave a comment below if you've got questions or other methods that you want to learn about. But for now, let's go back to the video. Our first digital product idea is music. Now if you can make the music yourself, that's great. But if not, you can always hire someone on Fiverr or Upwork to do it. If I were selling music online, the first thing I'd do is put some of my movies and songs up on YouTube without charging anything. Now, why on earth would I want to do that? That's because if enough people heard and liked that music, I'd have a great base from which to sell my higher quality music and grant licensing for its use. Also, you may sell your music on sites like Bandcamp and SoundCloud in addition to selling it on your website through your preferred payment processor. Number 2 on the list of potential digital product ideas is audiobooks. To make money off of selling ebooks, the subject matter of the ebooks doesn't have to be particularly in depth. An ebook needs only a few pages to be marketable if it gives any real benefit to the reader. Of course, if you already have the ebook, you might as well make an audiobook out of it. Either do it yourself or hire someone on Upwork.com to do it for you at a low cost. Also, a cheap microphone like the Blue Yeti Nano is available if you decide to record it yourself. When the time comes to make some money from your ebook, you can do so on websites like Amazon. You can make bundles that include not only the physical book and the audiobook, but also perhaps an extra course or screen recorded tutorials. Number 3 is Graphics Graphics for use on social media Digital drawings and logo graphics all fall within this category. You can see many more examples by visiting gumroad.com and clicking the Discover menu item. Once you've established yourself as a graphic designer and begun earning a living from your efforts, you may like to consider designing and selling a digital product in the form of an online course. Number 4 is Website Themes Use Elementor for WordPress or another similar tool to design a WordPress theme and then sell it on Marketplace like Theme Forest or Envato Elements. If you're enjoying this video so far, why don't you give us a thumbs up and don't forget to hit that subscribe button to see more of our videos. Now, let's get on with our list. Number 5 on the list of potential digital product ideas is design templates. If you go to Envato Elements website, you'll notice that you can offer templates for all sorts of things like video templates for video editing presentations, slideshow templates for things like Google Slides and Microsoft PowerPoint, and even graphic templates. Number 6 is writing bundles. You can sell writing bundles which are just templates for writing, to give people a starting point for their tweets, YouTube clips, or even blog posts. And a fantastic company that accomplishes this is Typeshare.co. They sell everything from tweet templates to essay templates, and these may be really helpful to other people who deal with writer's block by simply being plugged in. It provides a wealth of inspiration for what to write. Although these samples are merely text, they are of great use to people because, as I mentioned, they can break through writer's block. Number 7 in our list is ebooks. You may have seen ebooks for sale on sites like Amazon, Kindle, and assumed that only famous authors could write them. But this is not the case. You can make a lot of money by writing an ebook guide on how to do anything if you have the knowledge to do so. Gumroad.com, Amazon Kindle, or even your payment processor like Digistore24 may all be used to sell your ebooks. And all you have to do to get the product to customers is create a PDF version of the book that you have created using a tool like Google Docs. See, when it comes to creating an ebook, most people create one, sell it for $9, and then wonder why they aren't rolling in dough. That's because if you wanted to turn a profit of $100,000, you would need 11,111 sales. Number 8 is Online Courses In the last 10 years, online courses have been fantastic since they have provided us with some of the most useful knowledge and training available. 
Does this imply that there isn't a single bad online course? Not at all in any way. I've learned more from the online courses I've completed than I ever could have in a traditional classroom setting. You might assume that to teach something successfully in an online course, you need to be an absolute guru on the subject. If you know even 1% more than the average person about any topic, you can create a course and sell it online. You may create a course and charge people to learn nearly anything you know more about. The resources necessary to create an online course comprised of a series of videos in which you record yourself teaching any topic you like are readily available. You have the option of going to different sites such as Skillshare to try to learn new skills. Have you picked which digital product you'll try selling? Leave your answer in the comments below. Now, let's get back to our video. Number 9 is PDF Downloads Downloadable PDF documents can range from simple checklists to elaborate calendars, card layouts, and even resume samples. Online marketplaces such as Etsy include a plethora of vendors offering these PDF documents for sale if you simply visit that website. If you look for PDF forms or PDF downloads, you'll find many vendors offering to sell you one. PDF templates can be created from scratch using a program like Canva or as a starting point for a more elaborate design in Google Docs or Slides. From there, a PDF can be generated. Number 10 is Subscription-Based Services A membership site functions similarly to an online course in that the buyer is granted access to a private section of the site. But unlike online education, people don't pay for it once and then forget about it. Rather, they pay for it regularly. So, this is really beneficial to you. Customers benefit from purchasing memberships since fresh content is added to the site regularly, resulting in both recurrent revenue and customer satisfaction. They are therefore paying every month for fresh material. Also, I've come across certain YouTube channels whose primary source is to provide amusement. They offer a $10 monthly subscription. And if they have a million YouTube subscribers, even if only 1% of them sign up, they immediately generate more money from ad revenue in some circumstances. You can schedule frequent QA calls within your membership site, record them, and then upload them to your members area using a platform like Kajabi. You can make $50,000 monthly through a membership site if a thousand users pay $50 per month and it would keep happening every single month. You can still make a lot of money if you replace the people who leave the newcomers at a faster rate. Number 11 is software. Now this may sound daunting, and in many cases you indeed need to invest hundreds of thousands of dollars to produce software. But there are some alternate ways to go about creating software and selling it to potentially make money. The recurring revenue model, similar to that of membership sites, is particularly appealing making software enterprises an excellent investment opportunity. Building software might be intimidating, especially if you aren't a coder or don't have a lot of money. But you would be surprised at how many businesses would let you white-label their software and sell it under your brand. You'll just divide the profits with them. You can find many different instances of white-labeling software by searching Google. If your business is profitable over the long term, you may want to consider hiring software developers from websites such as Upwork.com. Last in our list are stock footage and pictures. If you have a high-quality camera or smartphone, you may generate money by selling stock footage of the people, places and things existing in your immediate vicinity to filmmakers for use in their documentaries, films and other creative projects. It's possible to make money off of them on websites like Pond5, Adobe Stock, and Shutterstock. In addition, you may want to consider investing in a drone of some sort to supplement the ground-level photography you will be doing for this digital product. Thus, you may be able to put your own spin on it, making it stand out from the crowd, and from there you might try selling on these platforms. When it comes to all of these different concepts for digital products, it all boils down to offering value to the final customer to whom you will be selling these things. So which of these products have you tried or are you willing to start using today? Let us know in the comments below. And if you have any tips, feel free to share them. Thank you very much for supporting us. We've enjoyed making this video for you today. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell if you haven't yet to make sure you don't miss out on any of our future uploads. You can also check out our channel to see more of our excellent content. Thank you and we'll see you in the next video.